Hello, hello, who is also Mr. Who Reviews. Today we are in Doctor Who, Invasion of the Dinosaurs. And this episode that takes place after uh, the Time Warrior. And the Doctor and Sarah are back in London in the 70s, 80s. And London seems to be a ghost town, even though there's a few uh, people looting there. And the Doctor and Sarah get confused for uh, looters, but that's a good thing because when they took their picture, the information went to uh, the Brigadier, so they have to find out where they are since uh, he's been waiting for the Doctor since the, this uh, crisis. Uh, uh, as he started after the Doctor and Sarah uh, disappeared. And the crisis? Dinosaur are showing up. Yeah! And uh, this uh, general known as General Finch. He seems that Marky and doesn't really believe uh, some of the theories that the Doctor has on dinosaurs and doesn't really treat as uh, Sarah Jane that well. And uh, turned out this. Uh, Scientist called Whitaker is involved since he has this uh, theory on time travel and we asked for a government fund and they thought he was a kook. But the guy behind the whole dinosaur thing, uh, Minister uh, Grover, as he hired him to do his time travel experiments, since he's all against the like, pollution and that he has the idea of put these people on uh, this big ship, a uh, spaceship, making them think they're going to uh, a new planet that's similar to Earth. But he just brought back the uh, time to like the Stone Age or so when the Earth was, was like clean and that. Uh, by doing that, uh, the ascend descendants. Of millions of generations of humans be uh, wiped out. Uh, mostly like the new people he picked are the great since uh, Sir Jane gets uh, captured and put on the ship and one of the elders is saying that if they can't uh, convince her to think their way that the killer. And the way they try to convince her of their way Re-education. Sarah Zane is put into a, a room with watching a, a propaganda a video of, of the evils of hum humanity. Like pollution, war, stuff like that. Yeah. Uh, I'm turning out that um, Captain Yates uh, is there with them as well. Well, with, with Grover and Matt. Since he's all for the off of the planet, and he's thinking that with the room empty, the air's cleaner, and there's no smog and that. And he does doesn't want the doctor to hurt him though. Uh, Whitaker and that one to sabotage the doctor's experiments, like trying to tranquilize a dinosaur and just messing with uh, some of his machines. And um, Yates isn't really happy when he heard that it, that it's T Rex that the Doctor got for unit and almost killed Sarah. So yeah, and at the end, when they find out that Yates uh, Brigadier has him put on the sick leave and then just get him to 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 leave when he's ready. Yeah. Sam on for a good character in the unit family. Uh, this episode is a bit preachy, talking about the, the environment and the evils of pollution and that. The song the doctor was the preachy about the global uh, pollution and, and that Ford in modern series. Even though I think it's worse now than it was back in the 1970s. 
on the, the time trial to the the they uh, the looter sorry they got like, had punished the looters. Yeah he doesn't doesn't even care to see the looters that have criminals upon them into a a factory for how many months until they get their uh, actual uh, sentence. Um the Grover's plan or whatever whatsoever was to to uh, discredit the doctor when they frame him on making the dinosaurs come was well, kind of good and I don't think the brigadier actually believed the doctor was behind it even though it, it looked like he was I think he was uh, playing along and Sarah Jane is kind of smart and the fools in this like she pretends to be on the the new people that side of the escape the uh, in, uh, the re education room but when F uh, General Finch comes by his respect he was with them oh. and the uh, Finch and the Grover just get set up in time and the doctor reverses uh, Whitaker's uh, a uh, time displacement thing and uh, uh, the dinosaurs look okay like some of them look realistic or it looks like some like a they put a toy in front of the thing like the like the thing they did for uh, the robot when the doctor drive up on Bessie when the uh, the robot got bigger and some click they're gonna they're in costume. I don't know. Oh yeah, and uh they did the who mobile in this look like someone from Back to the Future's uh 2015. And this young episode that's in I guess they couldn't afford to keep it for a while or not not many people liked it. Oh yeah, the first episode of this is in black and white. I hope when uh, they bring out season 11 on uh, the collector's box set, they have uh, all the episodes in colour. I think there's a pair of special features that puts in colour, but I can't remember. And I think it's the same thing with the wooden episodes from The Mod of Evil being in black and white. And the uh, perfect is a uh, good Goodness is wild as being a little funny and already and minding a tourney that much and just trying to convince the brigadier that the one the the, the minister and that are behind all things that's kinda good. And when he imagine Yates said uh, Brigadier didn't really believe it, like he, he believed a little that uh, Grover and Finch were uh, Involved in Yates since he's one of his, his men and just believe that he's the final orders. Oh, yeah, and like, uh, Sergeant Benton does that, Doctor uses a uh, the uh, karate on to escape, was kind of good. Um, yeah, it's a good episode, and I think it's one of the best from a uh, Pertree's era and the prison is more subtle than in a uh, uh or from 55 and uh next week we go on another uh, uh story arc but does uh half the episodes that the key to time was and the feature the fifth doctor and introducing uh, a new companion. Hmm. Anyway, that's it. I'll see you guys later.